What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we have a dual replay for you guys. This was sent in to me by uh, Forte, so be sure to check them out, link in the description. And uh, they are using uh, Performer Pals versus Fire Kings. And uh, yeah, within this replay, it's really cool because he's able to summon all of Yuya's main monsters. So let's go on ahead and uh, show this for you guys. And we're using Fusion Conscription, it's a good way to get Odd Eyes. So with Odd Eyes effect, you can of course just keep searching for different cards that you're going to need and uh, just get all the different pendulums and everything that you're going to need uh, for Performa Pals. Another Fusion Conscription. Really good idea too. I want to try this out after after this replay. And uh, yeah, I can go for Beast Eyes by using uh, Axe Dragonite because uh, it's uh, it just requires a Dark Dragon and a Beast Monster, so it's an easy way to bring out Beast Eyes. And with uh, Silver Claw, it will do uh, 1,800 damage because it does the damage of the attack of the Beast Monster used in the Fusion. So 1,800 damage. There you go, Fire King shenanigans going on over there. And here's a card that's really interesting. It's kind of like a new MST, and I think a lot of people will be using it whenever it does come out for us. It's uh, Galaxy Cyclone, and what you do is you can target a set Spell or Trap card on the field and destroy it. And during your main phase, except turn this was sent to the graveyard, you can banish it from your graveyard and then target a face up Spell or Trap on the field and destroy it. You can only activate this once per turn. So it's uh, really useful. You basically get to destroy uh, two Spell and Traps, one being face down, and then one face up. So, uh, interesting card being used there. I don't think I've seen anyone really use it. And then, of course, also having Pot of Riches, which is kind of like a uh, Pot of Avarice for uh, Pendulums, because you're able to return Pendulums and then draw two cards. Three Pendulums and then draw two cards. So you can see, still having Beast Eyes over there, and uh, able to do some pretty good damage. I mean, with that 1,800 attack for Silver Claw, it helps out with uh, doing some pretty good damage with Beast Eyes. See, after that, you're seeing a lot of set cards from the Fire King player. So again, Cyclone, getting rid of Soul Morning at least. And uh, with Trump Witch, too, you can get a Polymerization, so that helps him out, too, because he does use Rune Eyes in this build, of course, so very useful on that. And with uh, Battle Fader and everything, he's uh, just seems like that's all they have is a bunch of really good trap cards on their side of the field. It's kind of scary. So then uh, bringing out Lizard Draw. Yeah, like I said, it looks just like Charmander to me. But, uh, of course, uh, Torrential Tribute. So that gets rid of all the cards, and uh, again, rid of their own Fader, they get to draw two cards from it. So it works out really well for them. Again, with Odd Eyes and everything, so you can get the cards he needs. He then uses Galaxy Cyclone, so we can get rid of the Pendulum Wizard, and then go for Time Gazer and Stargazer. Then uh, you have uh, Time Gazer and Stargazer on the field, which is Yuya's original monster, so it's really cool to see those actually being used in this. And uh, he then Pendulum summons a bunch of monsters to his side of the field, including uh, multiple Odd Eyes, and even able to go for Rune Eyes. But Mirror Force, yeah, that kind of gets around it. But at least you can still attack with uh, Rune Eyes. Still gets to keep that on the field, so... Yeah, unfortunately, all those monsters just getting destroyed. And uh, there's all the Fire Kings. But at least he had his own Torrential Tribute, so that kind of works out for him. And Fire King's uh, main monster, Grunix. Always a scary card. And then even having a Lava Lance Lord, which can be just normal summoned, but it's destroyed there in the end phase. Still does uh, really good damage though, 2100. It's nothing to laugh at. And uh, here we go, here's the big play. Being able to summon all these different monsters. So with this, you have uh, Stargazer, uh, Silver Claw, two of Odd Eyes, and then a uh, Pendulum Wizard. With Wizard, you can get rid of both the Pendulum monsters, and then you can get uh, two Performer Pal monsters from your deck to your hand, giving him some other Performer Pals he will need. So instantly going for Dark Rebellion Dragon. Then after that, Trump Witch to Pendulum Zone, which will help you go for Rune Eyes Pendulum Dragon. And then after that, we have, because uh, it's Contact Fusion for Beast Eyes, so Silver Claw, and then Odd Eyes to make, of course, Beast Eyes. So there you go, all three of them on the field. That's so cool to see this uh, deck that can actually do that. Then Dark Rebellion's Effect, Weakening Grunix, and uh, here comes all the damage, basically. There's nothing that the Fire King player can really do, because there's a lot of damage going after him. With these dies too, it's, it doesn't matter if you're destroying a defense monster anyway, because you're still going to inflict some damage because of that uh, beast monster, and uh, there you go. He wins the duel. So it's really cool to see all three of those monsters in the field. Too bad we don't have the new XC Pendulum card, and that's what he was telling me to in the message. Too bad we won't have that on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro, because he probably could have gone for that if he would have, you know, maybe if the other two uh, Pendulum monsters too were actually made into cards that help turn XC ranks into levels or whatever. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the duel. I thought it was amazing to see those three on the field together. I want to try out something now with Performa Palace. I really haven't tried anything on them, but now this makes me really want to. So uh, thank you again to Forte for sending me this duel replay. And uh, of course, if you guys want to send in your own duel replay where there's something amazing happening like this, an OT 
OTK, something just cool happened in the duel or funny even, uh, just send it to me through my Facebook page and uh, you can just send the replay file whether it's from Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro or Death Pro and also include your YouTube uh, username, a link to your channel so I can uh, of course give you a shout out. As always, thank you for watching, me to comment, rate, and subscribe, and of course, I will catch you guys later. See ya. Hope you guys have enjoyed my latest video. Be sure to subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, as well as check out my other two channels, Cyber Knight Games for Let's Plays, and also a Cyber Knight CCG for Card Fight Vanguard openings. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. See ya.